Uh, I knew that'd be first question. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I was coming after workouts and uh, I got in the shower and uh, I had my suit on my locker. I put my jacket on, my shirt on, I had my pants on, and I was getting my shoes on. And I was about to tie my shoes and I bent over and I just heard a split. I'm like, oh man. That's been quite a workout. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we didn't really do like lifting stuff, but we just actually don't feel stuff, so yeah. So they make you work out before they make you come down here? Yeah, we, we just got to work out. Us three, we was like, yeah, we just got to work out there. So, so they know. So you said he had to twist your arm a little bit to come down here. When he first asked you, I, I know you don't love media and yeah. doing the media stuff, so when he first asked you, were you nervous? Or did you think about saying no? I was really nervous. Uh, he had told uh, me, like, Sue and Lex, uh, she had told me, I'm like, I'm excited about it. So, yeah, I was really excited about it. I'm really nervous about it. Yeah. That was a great opportunity. So. Do you feel like this is a time where you can sort of become a vocal leader or a guy? You know? Yeah, definitely. You know, I, I'm an actual user, so I'm going to do some more stuff vocal leader. You know, that's what I was close to. Everybody, everybody all the coaches tell me to do it. I'm more vocal and stuff like that. So, I'm using it to do my vocal leader. So. Last year was really your first year playing full time. What, what, what do you want to take and build on that coming in your second year? Uh, just my confidence, really, and uh, just building everybody else around me, the whole, the whole team, really, you know. I had a whole year, uh, year before that, I played like, six games, so uh, getting a whole year out there just made me boost my confidence and uh, go to myself as a leader, really. There's a bunch of you Kentucky guys on various watch lists and award lists and people sort of picking Kentucky as a sleeper in this league. Do you get a sense walking around here and just hearing and reading that stuff that there's an increased level of respect for your program now? Oh, yeah, definitely. You know, I respect uh, the love you have. Um, yeah, people call us a sleeper. Uh, I just said we're going to come up, really, and uh, everybody just needs to watch out for us. Uh, we're going to come up, really, and get these wins. Do you, think, do you think the other teams in this league are, have sort of taken notice of, of what you guys started to do by the end of last season? Oh, yeah, definitely. You know, uh, some teams that we didn't beat the year before we beat this year, and uh, just coming up getting more wins and uh, staying in the game with other other teams. So, play more teams are respect us more. How much better do you think the defense can be than it was a year ago when you guys had all those new guys and you were trying to break people in? Oh yeah, it's definitely should be uh, better. You know, we got nine ten starters, so uh, that's that's great for us um, and build our chemistry, everybody around us. So uh, yeah, that's, that's great for us that we we turn it now. What do you think you guys will do better defensively this time? Oh, uh, you know, we always uh, harp on creating turnovers. We ain't getting them turnovers we did as opposed to. So, uh, creating turnovers just being more disciplined, really, and make more plays. Is there a difference between a DJ Elliott defense and a Matt House defense? Uh, not really much much um, differences, but um, Coach House, has, he, he's a great coach, he's a great defense coordinator, he's uh, all around the players, you know, take us outside, off the field, and on the field, so uh, I really like Coach House too, but uh, you know, Coach Stoops helps, helps on the defense, and defensive backs uh, in my position, so. Yeah. How much does Coach Stoops work with you guys? I know he's worked with a lot of great defensive backs in the past. Uh, he helps us a lot, uh, like sometimes we work, work in film, he walk, walks to the film room and uh, helps us out and stuff like that, so uh, that's great having him as a defensive back coach. Not counting your Split pants. Is, it, is this a thing that guys seem like guys get a, a, a kick out of come, being able to come here and kind of dress up and show off your fashion sense? Oh yeah, definitely. You know, trying to get my looks right. So uh, yeah, but other than the split pants, yeah, I feel great. <laughs> what was the fix for that? 